Welcome to On The Shears Buses, doing a obviously video on Hertfordshire route, joined by Robert. Hello guys. And Josh. Good morning. So, yeah, as I said, uh, you probably know me from previous videos. So yes, it is Rob from On The Shears Buses. Ben is your driver for today. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. You'll see in our previous episode, so he's gonna just basically drive around in a bus. I'm gonna tell him where to go, and that's it. And obviously, Josh, he's here for a bit of the action, too. So, I'm here for moral support. <laughs> so, yeah, Ben, just describe us through what we're doing. Okay, so yeah, we're going on to a route, we're doing a 300 from Stevenage all the way up to Galileo. I was just about to say, that looks suspiciously like Stevenage bus station, but that makes sense now. Yeah. Just head off. Head off. Yes, as we're just on time now. One time, we're half a minute late. <laughs> we get it up. So, uh, Josh, how late do you get at the airport? Um, we don't actually have a specific set timetable. Uh -huh. So, um, we, we have three, three routes. Um, on two of the main kind of commuter ones, there are two buses, so we try to keep them at every fifth. So what we'll do? Is uh, we I haven't got just a ticket selling on today. The, the full route test takes 15 minutes, so we just when you get to one end, you radio the other guy to say you're leaving, and then he leaves. So there's no set timetable. It's just roughly every 15 minutes, yeah. and if it's not, cut it. Yeah. So Ben, yeah, you're at the right stop. Yeah, I thought so. Today we're not doing ticket selling, we're just... Free rides. Yeah. Like in the airport. That's what I do. So yeah, Ben, feel free to ask questions if you want. Obviously you're driving. Will do. I kind of do remember most of this, so... Yeah, I'll... If you need help just... on what way to go, just let me know. Will do. It's just straight only, on. I only I've ever used the 301, like, once. If I go to Stevenage, I go straight from here, so I just take 100. So, yeah, is it straight ahead on the roundabout? Yep, straight ahead. Straight ahead. So, what bus are we in today, uh, Ben? So, yes, we're in the C. C I forgot what it is. C2G, is it? Uh, the. Uh, we're not in a Bendy. No, just the uh, Solo 2012 Hamburg. Well, yeah, all the links yeah. you need are in the uh, description, guys. Even the link to our Facebook page. You going straight ahead? Like it. No, you go. Wait, what route are we doing? 300? 300. Do a left. This is really confusing because it's in. Obviously, it's a German game, so you're driving on the wrong side of the road. And also, they've missed out an exit. You'll know, uh, Josh. <laughs> this message. Oh, with yeah, my mind. we're going for As the Dust, right? They've missed out the uh, Six Hills Way exit. So they have. I yeah. say you complain and get your money back. <laughs> yeah, this is a free, <laughs> this is free. Yeah, this is free add on. It's which easy. will be in the info box at the bottom. Description. In that case, I suggest you write and get somebody else's money back. <laughs> oh gosh, you sound like my friend David. Literally, you actually literally sound near enough like him. Good morning, guys. Afternoon. Welcome aboard. We're on the 300. This People is... never say hello. Oh, so Unless do. you want a ticket. <laughs> that's that's. That's like the first rule of being a bus driver. Nobody says hello. <laughs> well, it doesn't matter for you. Okay, you're, where you're about for free service. Do it right. Do it right. right. Yeah, because you've got a free service, Josh. Yeah, but people... <laughs> yeah, but you still say hello to the driver, because I'm still here. Yeah. If you want to see uh, any of Josh's driving, please, please view his channel and subscribe. Some of his videos are on our channel too, because he's part of our little uh, organisation. So feel free to watch them, give them a like. And subscribe for more content. I'm going to go over the speed a bit just of, like, to get the time up. Levels. Yep, I agree. I agree for that to uh, Ben. Maybe you forgot your name there. <laughs> I love the way you say like organisation like with some kind of master criminals. Like, yep, he's in the gang too. Yep. Don't worry, it's going strong. We've got 114 likes so far. 
please, please raise that number. Last time I did say we That's needed to get to the hundred mark. What are you saying, Josh? Stop it, Ben. No, no, no one's getting on. No one's getting off, and no one wants Sorry. to get on. <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't see. Straight it's on. Yeah, yeah it's on. dead on. It's dead end. <laughs> Elder way. I genuinely thought you were going to hit that truck then. Same here. So yeah, you using the keyboard? Yeah. I'd recommend you get a mouse. Yeah, we'll do. <laughs> this <laughs> might help. Yeah, mouse <laughs> might help. Someone wants to get on. Someone wants to get on. Drive faster, drive faster. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes I drive too fast and go right past the stop. Guess where we... <laughs> Guess where we are, Josh? At a bus stop. No, guess where? If you've been on, you'll know where it is if you've been on the circulars. Airport? No, we're in Stevenage. <laughs> hey, I've only ever been to Stevenage like I've only ever been on three hundred one like once or twice, okay. and I've only ever I, I don't go to Stevenage. Why? You, you, you've seen you've seen the other side of it. That was Roaring Meg Retail Park. Yeah, I, know, I like. I mean, I know, I know where I'm going, but this Bus. obviously because it's it, it doesn't. Bus. I don't think it resembles it that well. If I if I'm truthfully honest. Bus, look. Oh. Give it a horn. Straight ahead. That's or a middle finger, either one. <laughs> <laughs> you should you should see what we do to each other when we drive past. You do get all kinds of funny. <laughs> oh, when yeah, you should have seen it there, Zan. Have you ever? Do you play music out loud when you're driving? Um, they ask us not to, but there's a couple of us that just kind of put a radio in the window and just turn it up to glass so we can't hear what passengers are saying. Go on, Zan. Uh, um, but I, I don't really. I'm, you know, do a left hit. Yeah, I, I don't really listen to music. Fair well. enough. I just. Yeah. This should be where Dunnell Mill is. Because my okay. family is from Stevenage. I know this is Dunnell Mill. I've been forced to watch this on a very small phone screen. I'm being and... forced to watch this on Skype screen share. Yes, that's better than a small phone screen. <laughs> yeah, well, at least I... it'll be in a better quality ratio. Although I must say that the, um, the cab does look pretty realistic, though. Yeah. It's an official add-on. That's I think. It looks look quite, look quite like the ones we drive. Yeah. Except it's missing a couple of things though. Um, so yeah, when you can, if you can get an exterior view, Ben, see what the registration plate is. Obviously not now. What is it? It's yeah. When we're at the next bus stop, we'll do it. Yeah, when someone wants to get on. Yeah, I think now at Tesco. At Tesco. Get your horse burgers, get your horse burgers. <laughs> Quit, let's go before they fin us. Let's go before they fin us. Get it? Fin us and us, man? Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, it's BX64WHK. Oh. Hey, she doesn't want to get on. For those of you who have watched my videos, you'll know that's one of the ones that I drive. Ironic. I want to get on. I know what you should do, Ben. When when the doors are opening, you know you put the uh, uh, bus stop brake on or the parking brake. Yeah. If you release that before you shut the doors, you can make a breeze. What's called what I call a breeze. It's so good. Do a right. Okay. You should. Instead of because on on the Mercedes, I don't know if um, obviously because this is kind of a video game. I don't know if it'd do the same thing. Um, but on our ones, if you are only stopping for a short amount of time, if you open the doors, that actually activates a brake. So instead of having to go to put the parking brake on, you just open the doors, then shut them again, and it will release the brake automatically. So it's like an automatic yeah, uh, bus station brake. So in, in, in theory, we've got three brakes. We've got one, which is like the master handbrake. Yeah. Which is on our on big right. One. Big, then, yeah, big we've got thing. one that's just by the doors. And then we've got obviously the actual door one itself. 
Which I must say is very useless if you're on a hill. <laughs> I have tried that many of times and have failed aggressively. Some buses have good kickdowns uphill. The Eclipse Urban's quite a nice one. So right, we're coming out of Stevenage now, I do believe, Ben. Yes. Into No, oh. never off. How late are we? I can't see. 0 0.8. Not Zero too point bad. Pick up a bit of speed. It's the national speed limit. Somehow the cars don't like to do the national speed limit. They like to do 40 miles an hour. <laughs> Most probably the MP drivers as well. <laughs> yeah. Are you thinking that 40 miles an hour isn't the national speed limit? No, it's because they read it in our kilometres now, I do believe, in the editor. So you've got to convert it. That'll be why I get middle fingers from other cars. <laughs> <laughs> well, because they're uh, they've just gone in on the Wizz Air flight from uh, Amsterdam. And they're stuck with me all the way from Carlton. <laughs> like you know, you guys would be lost without us. Well, well, I'm fine. You know me. I'm from the area. I'm fine. <laughs> yeah, you get you get really stupid people, right? that say, like, they get on and they say, do you go to the train station? No. You get the bend for that. Go. I go to the car park. It says on the Hanover blind. Mid-term oh, park. Some That's people fine. don't read it. <laughs> they just see a bus and get on. Bit laggy here. Yeah, you're, you're bound to drop your frame rate a little bit here. It's frozen on me a few times, I must say. Yeah, yeah, because obviously you're seeing what I'm seeing. And I'm seeing what Ben's seeing. <laughs> Ben's seeing what the bus driver's seeing. <laughs> yeah, as I said, Josh, you sound exactly like my friend David. Stay on, is yeah. That... What? Is that a good thing, or is he some kind of, like, you know, mafia or something? No, good thing. Alright, okay. Yeah, he's, well, he's, 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 I say if you like absolutely hate him, like can't stand him. No, he literally he's literally exactly like you and he sounds near enough like you. Wow. I hate well, we were meant to be at this stop ten seconds ago. Really? Doing on no. time, we're catching up. Straight on yeah. Straight on, yeah, yeah. There it's, it is. Neb the Nebworth Centre is supposed to be called Station Road. I know that because I've been in Nebworth. I love the way Ben's like really worried because he was meant to be at that stop two seconds ago. <laughs> ben, when I'm, I should have been at stop 30 minutes ago, I wouldn't worry about it. <laughs> it's not a big thing. No. So would you like to become a bus driver when you're older, Ben? I actually have to try to, but due to medical reasons, oh, unfortunately, sure. I can't. I can't. I'm not. I can't. I'm blind in one eye, unfortunately. So. Ah, uh, sorry. Don't do it. Don't do it. You could. Don't do it. Straight ahead. Straight ahead. No, I it's thought she was. Gonna, I thought she was going to walk out in front of me. Then. Does she want to die? Yeah, keep going straight. I'll let you know when to turn. No one wants to get off. Because of your bad, because of your good driving, shall I say? I was about to say bad. <laughs> but then I can't say that. Eh, I can. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm not bad. Have you watched my uh, OMSI videos, uh, Josh? Um, I haven't. You should. Give them a watch. Yes. Great, great laugh. Yeah, definitely. Oh, the next bus. Yes, it's white. You'd never have thought that. Should be silver. No, they're they're the older versions. It's because um, you've, I don't think you got the repaint pack installed. No. That's oh. why. They should be oh, a reaver. The bus, the bus with Ben should be silver. <laughs> All right. Unless you're in the uh, the bad bus, as we call it, because we've got one from the old fleet before they give us the new buses, because uh, they were one down. Uh, and it's an old uh, Blue Tech 3 Sitaro. Oh. Um, it's it's quite nice. Um, but, you know, all the other ones are silver, and it, yes. it, it, it's bright white, sticks out like a sore thumb. 
see, I haven't got any ever uh, repaints for this bus yet, so. Yeah, I, I find there it, is available. Yeah, I find it quite hard to uh, repaint this bus for some reason because you've got all the different files and whatnot, and I keep on getting uh, white lines, white little dots on the uh, bus. Just, just a question, Ben. Yeah. If you look up a second, like in in the game, right. can you have you got the controls above your head, or is it just the controls you see in front of you? Um, oh, what are you looking for? The uh, Hanover controller. Yeah. I was, I was just looking generally. Have you got controls to your left hand side as well? Because it should be right, but it's the wrong way around. So yeah, have you got controls to your left side as well? Um, I think we do. I think we've got like air conditioning and whatnot. Yeah. As far as I can remember. Yeah, they're down there as well, somewhere. Yeah, and we don't have uh, all our positioning, window, window opening. Uh, and on the newer Sitaros, you can actually control the blind from a control. You don't actually have to get up and reach and pull the cord down. You can just do it by itself. Pull the cord. It sounds like you're um, you're in a toilet and need help. <laughs> uh, no, yeah, but it's, it's it's so it's so much saves so much time. You don't have to reach out. You just press the button. It does it all by itself. Yeah, we're in a uh, warmer green now. I've never heard of that place. It's on its way to a uh, Welling Garden City. Why do you like to approach every bus stop, Ben, as if someone wants to get off? <laughs> well, you never know. They won't last minute. Last minute ditch attempt. <laughs> Some people do in real oh, life. Oh. Get me started on the amount of people that. Last they seconds. They say, oh shit, one bus stop. Okay, get off. Just, just before you come me. up to the stop, they press the button. And you don't stop because they just pressed it just so you can't stop. They say, Why didn't you stop? You didn't press the button. Yes, I did. No, you didn't. I mean, it's. It's, it's not there. It's shut. And they just expect you to know where they want to get off and when, they're, when they want to get off and whatnot. Exactly. Uh, only a year. Not very long. You enjoy it? You have to be 21 to be able to drive a bus, uh, and I'm only 22, so yeah, just just under a year. I swear, like uh, Arriva London, I swear they can re they recruit at 19. Metroline, Metroline recruit at 18. Uh, no, I have to have a full bus license. Please. Did you have to pay for your PSV? Yeah, I do, because I put it back privately. Well, like, not through a company. How much does it cost to uh, get a PSV? I cannot even remember. A few grand? Oh, yeah, it's not, not cheap, not cheap. I can't... wouldn't be able to tell the exact price, but no, they don't come cheap. Because so I was thinking of, say, working at a Reaver when I'm older. Don't do it. No, I want to do it. I'm, you know I'm a bus enthusiast. I'm doing it. That's what I said. I said I want to drive buses. A few days later, I was like, I don't want to do this anymore. What, because you find it boring? No, I love it. It's just the amount of crap that people do. Yeah? Chris Rumins, an Arriva driver at Hemel, he had chicken and chips on board his Green Line coach. <laughs> I mean, when you... Because, like, Arriva is, like what I call like a proper company is we're only kind of like little shuttle buses so like it's not I wouldn't you're say peasants. It's... you're sorry you're peasants yeah we're like the um the grunts of the industry now I thought, that's, I thought that's the Thameslink shuttle train we're, we're down there with minibus drivers <laughs> the island ride <laughs> yeah yeah it does. are you early North Star. I think you might have gone past the North Star. Oh, yeah. <laughs> You'll have to wait. You'll have to wait. You'll have to go further. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's, that's the only problem there. Is the passenger wanted the North Star. <laughs> yeah, you'll have to. You'll have to uh, turn around where possible. <laughs> yeah, um, they have to go back the whole route. That that happened once. Oh, 
but we have a we have a stop where you can't stop going into the tunnel, but you can stop coming out. So these these um I think they uh, Eastern European of some description. Um, they got went to get off, and I said you can't get off here. And I was like, well, if you want to get off here, you have to come up to the terminal and back again. I'm, you know, I'm willing to take you. So they say, all right. So I was. There, there's a there's a couple of my mates that kind of you know work at the airport, um, and one of them was on his way home. So I sort of I sort of have them standing by the cab, you know, just someone's chat to, um, and obviously chatting away. Um, completely slipped my mind, so I go straight past the stop, round the roundabout, up the road, um, and it's not until I get sort of 15 minutes away I think. Well, yeah, there's people want to go. <laughs> So how fast are you going in this thing? How many kilometers an hour? Is this, this is in kilometers an hour, by the way. So yeah, yeah, it's, it's doing about 35. What's the small number? The small number in the middle is the air. Miles an hour. Yeah, no, not the uh, recording bit. We're on about, oh yeah, your speed, yeah. Can't you see it from the speedo by the steering wheel? It should be the left dial. Yeah, it's yeah, that's all right. Slowing down. You're doing um, a straight ahead here. Because the on on Mercedes, it's the wrong way around. There's yeah, kilometers it's British. On the outside, and the miles are on the inside. I don't know what way it is here. I uh, no, that's that's clear as on our ones. I've I've gone a few times going, oh my god, I'm speeding, that's... and then realised I've the wrong way around. and gone, oh no, maybe not. That's... Hello, mate. Did you press the horn as well? Yeah. Uh oh, they're gonna have a walk. She's a child. She's a child. She'll be fine. <laughs> See what what I get right is I, I I've done that before, right? and people say, oh, you missed the bus stop. And, you know, you say, oh, I'm, I'm very sorry, you know, it happens. And they go and walk in the same direction you're travelling. Like, if anything, I've just done you a favour. Left, man. Left. Yeah, you've done them a favour. <laughs> it just, and they, they just get so rude, and they're like, oh, yeah, but you missed the bus stop. Yeah, but you're going this way. I've done you a favour. <laughs> get over yourself. We'll just see how... Yeah, I'm just seeing how far we're doing, so I think we'll probably be better off finishing the recording off at Welling Garden City. Yeah, yeah, I'm on the yeah, and then we can uh, finish the rest of the route off without recording. Okay. Um, yep, yeah, you keep going straight here. So yeah, this stops the timing point, so you better stop if you're early. We are five minutes. Stop. There we are. That's nice. So, what are your uh, laptop specs then, uh, Ben? Just what um, tell you. Gigahertz, that's not bad. Does it overclock? Do you know whether it overclocks or not? No, I don't know. Okay, that, that doesn't matter. Yeah. 2.6 is feasible. And I bought it last year. Mm. It's a year old now. Not bad. This, the laptop I'm using, the ones that I uh, do my Helen tutorials on, guess what the processor is on that? Very high. No, you wouldn't expect oh. it. Go on, Ben, have a guess. Two, 1.7. And it doesn't overclock. Are we, um, no, no, we'll stop it at Welling Garden City. I'll let you know uh, when. That was church, was it? This is Welling. Welling isn't in Welling Garden City. Oh, right, okay. Sounds similar. This used to be called Old Welling when Welling Garden City wasn't a garden city. It was just a garden. <laughs> Gosh, come on. That's not nice. Yeah, keep going straight. I'll let you know when to turn. So 
So is um is this route in real life a sapphire service? No, that's the other one. Three oh one. No one oh no. They, the 301 into work, they're not running Sapphire service. They're running every 15 minutes, though. Because I've, I've seen, um, I, I don't know if our viewers are part of it, but I've, I've seen on a really UK enthusiasts, there's been a few Sapphire buses on it, so I was just wondering. Yeah, no, um, no, that's, that, I am, I'm on there. Um, no, um, no, that's just, that was before it was branded, weren't it? That was a 3775, I do believe. Uh, I, I think so, yes. Yeah, um, no. The I'm 100... Just, the I'm 100... Just on Facebook now to try and find the photo. No, the 100, 101 and 102, that's, uh... That's Sapphire. Okay. Yeah, I got a, a letter through my door about that. Did you? Yeah. Well, I didn't. <laughs> yeah. You're not... If you just look through the thingy camera... What? Yeah. Okay, well, I'll have a look. Um, yeah, it's, um... It just, it's literally just a frequency guide, it's got the times, uh, and what Sapphire is, it's got a little coupon for me, uh, buy one get one free on any single or return journey. But you don't need it don't you? No we still have to pay, we only get a reduction, us, us at the airport, but with Reva, we only get a reduction. Ah. We don't actually, we still have to pay. Oh because I thought with your uh, C, C, B, uh, CP that you've actually got a... Uh... A blue badge. No. You will do eventually, though, wouldn't you? Hopefully. Mm. It's not not a nice story, you know. People that got these uh, things that sh shouldn't be happening to them. Do a left. Quirks. The quirks. Do a left. Go on. Well, Ben, what happened there? Did you see that, Johnny? I didn't. Uh, Josh, sorry. Johnny is in, just thought of, is another name. I was talking to him on Facebook. Okay. Yeah, I just pressed the wrong button. Uh, I just took and turned the camera in. Uh, you do. You go straight ahead here. Try if only I, could, when I was driving, just press the wrong button and you know just send somebody into the self destruct or something. Open the em no. Can you actually press a button and open the emergency exit door? Uh, we don't actually have them on these C2Ks because the windows are actually breakable. Oh, good. So I can get a sledgehammer then. Good. Because you do get a lot of people that are, you know, really like, where's the exit? And like, you just punch the window. Man. Yeah. Where? I'll get, I'll get me sledgehammer out. But in, if if you think about it, right? We've, we've got because we we're quite a busy service, so we've got dual doors anyway. So we don't actually need one because you just use the back door. Well, so do you face many um, really like rude and drunk people? You're right. <laughs> do, do I? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Loads of oh dear, we just, we just kind of, but because like with a um, with like a pay for service, you know, like 301 or a standard service, you would have to kind of make them pay. But on ours, as, as long as they get on and sit down, I couldn't care what they are to be honest. I'm getting paid for doing it when exactly. the 100 people or two people get on. Straight ahead. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, mind the curve. Yeah, we're in plenty of time. We're not due until 40, so another minute and a half yet. I do believe Shards with School's coming up soon. Yeah, it is. See what, what I would thought that they would have done is they would have made it so that it interlinked with the real time. It's, it sort of does because it sort of operates out of the fictional Wellington City uh, depot, which is by the uh, bus station. Right. So he's trying to keep it at the similar frequency. Right. Okay. But yeah, he's, so he's when, when, when you're still playing the game, uh -huh. does it actually like give you? The actual time, or does it give you like a made-up time from the it'll, game? It'll give you the uh, time that's set in the editor because you have to make the tracks and trips yourself. Ah, right, okay. So that's it. Also, he's planning to make it left path so we can run an Enviro 400s or uh, Dennis darts on there. Do a right of the yes. traffic lights. Okay. Yeah, we can run Enviro 200s. We can run. 
we can run quite a few good buses on there. <laughs> run it, run it, run it, run it. Good boy. And then you want to be doing a right as you're coming into a... I think mm, it's the time and point as well. Yeah, it is. I, I, so how long do we have to get to the route now, then? Uh, probably about, I'd say, another ten minutes. What, until we finish recording or to the end of the route? Finish recording. Oh, that's cool, yeah. And also, with this, the good thing what they've done on this, you know when it's the time and point is zero, zero at the end. Yep. And there's our other bus. And we've got another one and a half minutes right here. That's good, I can have a little stretch. Yeah. <laughs> Rest. Have a talk. Why don't you give us an, a little tour of the bus? Yes. Yes. Walk round check. You have to do your walk round check. Didn't do that when we started. <laughs> <laughs> there so it you have is. To go around ticking all these things in this little box. <laughs> Let's just check the indicators are working properly. Yeah. Let's then, mess around for another minute. <laughs> <laughs> so what, what destination points have you got to there, mate? Um, what different destinations? Because surely if it's... So you know, like you can have stuff like, you know, not in service or special event or training or, you know, uh, dropping off only... Don't press cancel or, though, don't... When yeah, you do I'm not doing cancel. it, yeah, because it will ruin... It will ruin that. But we've got you basically got not in service or Reva. Yeah. Steve. So it's just so it's just kind of your, your standard bog standard kind of stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Right. Yeah. Um, what I was going to say though is a matrix display they've done. They've made it a matrix display, so you basically. Yeah, that's that's what we've got as well on our one. Just the standard matrix. Yeah. Which is controlled by the little ticket machine and timing point thingy, which is there. Right. And that's the little... Let's leave. Yes. You'll be yeah, doing all right. Just a couple of minutes early, you know, just to kind of make sure that the, um, you know, because if we get traffic, then obviously you'll be late, won't you? Yeah. yeah. Just, just, just to kind of sort of, you know, make sure something. Yeah, yeah, exactly. This road in real life actually has speed humps, little square ones. Alright. Oh, those are the worst. I love them. Well, actually, no, I don't. I love the full-size ones that you get at caravan parks. Should we no, put... see, when, when I'm driving, I always try to avoid those by making it go to the centre of the bus. Yeah, that's what my dad yeah. does. The, the, the wheels on ours are so wide that when you do it, you actually end up getting... Like, you end up going over the other side one. It's, it's doesn't it, well. Yeah, it's the same. Yeah, I've seen it before, obviously, in buses and whatnot. You should have seen it in one bus one time. We were going through... Um, Lucy Farm down Thomason Avenue, right? On uh, right, yeah. on the Z bus. Um, right. And there was uh, two maniacs. I knew I knew who one of them was. I'm not obviously going to say, but they're not my mates or anything. I'm not, I just know it's who they are. And they were, they were on mo motorbikes. And um, the one was on a motorbike. And actually, no, they weren't on a motorbike. One was in a Voxlastra, and another one was in a, a black car of some sort. And they were basically racing down there, literally. Oh my god. The driver had to uh, put her on. Whoa. See, our really quiet. Our, our, our horns are, you could clap louder than our horns. Not good at all. Drive, drive, drive. drive, 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 drive we're drive. going. Drive, 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 come on. It doesn't matter if you hit them, you'll be late, come on. It doesn't matter, <laughs> collisions are turned off. Yeah. <laughs> What's turned off side in here? Collisions. <laughs> so in theory, we're just glitching, you'll go straight through the bus. Yep. And you can go through cars, you can do everything. Only it just makes my life a hell of a lot easier, that's why I turned it off. I just hate having to deal with all the click, clicking OK. Yes, I've hit something. What do do? Yeah. Come on, welcome aboard. Come on, here we go. Come on, welcome on to this uh, premium service here. And it's quite warm bus now. What's the temperature? Oh no, you've crashed. Now you have to fill out an AIC form. Oh uh, no. Now you have to, yeah, an incident it's report 19 form. 19 degrees today. Uh, we, we call them accident and incident form, but yeah, same thing. So. Then you have to go to the hire company like they did in Top Gear. <laughs> you do a left somewhere, I'll let you know where. 
So we're about. So where are we now? We're going towards. Yeah, it's probably. Wait, no, keep going. No. I'll let go where. Um, we're going towards Welling Garden C. We're about five minutes away. Ah, oh, right, yeah. Got enough stuff here. Okay, so, yeah, what's this stop called? Uh, Oakdale. Oakdale, yeah, so we're near. That's what you're jumping on. Yep, a bald guy. Bald guy wearing shirt and tie. What's the temp? Do you know what the temperature outside is? Uh, it's a bit No, keep going straight, yep. Ooh, Don't. Down here. Yeah. Down here. Time to... Now shot the next stop. Right. It's not that great. Nope. You slow down slow down to a uh, slow down to about twenty miles an hour, so that's about thirty kilometers an hour, just so I know when to turn left. Which well, I do believe here. could be here. Wait, no, no stop. stop Alright, stop here. Dead end. Stop here. This is Kirkland's, right? Yeah. So the next one, so go forward, it must be the next left then. Well, I saying, it's dead end. Yeah, I just realised it must be the next left. Sorry guys, if I was actually driving I'd know, but obviously I'm watching somebody else drive it, so... It's a bit hard. That's, that's the only thing, like, I don't think I would be able to handle a complex route. Because, like, on, on our one, yeah. literally, it's onto the main road, across the rest of the belt, down, down there, into the corner, come back again. Left here. Yeah. I don't think I could do turn left here, turn right. Yeah, but you're... I just, I just don't think I could do it. You're starting to learn the routes on Luton Depot now, aren't you? Yeah, but, I mean, like, like, like I say, I was literally just out of the terminal, across the roundabout, out onto the main road, turn on left, into the way. Park, turn around and come back again. Yeah. Easy. Turn right. Do this. Do that. Yeah. Well, I know. I know all the Luton Depot routes off by heart by looking at the map. But whereas I haven't actually been on all of them personally. Well, I probably have. But there's some of them where there have been bad, bad times I've had. And obviously, I don't remember. I know if I say go on Street View, and I say right, I remember the map. I'll say 14 right. It goes goes down here. It goes down North Street, down Wenlock Street, down Richmond Street, up the hill. So you, you'd, you'd be able to do it if you were on board and the driver was lost up there? Yeah, there was, there was one time, we're on the uh, 37 I do believe, the drive, it was in the old Scanners. Right, yep. The driver got lost. I knew the route, I was probably about 8 at the time. Okay. And yeah, the driver got lost and he went up, he went up uh, Pointers Road, he'd done that bit right. Um, he went, he missed out Lee Grave High Street, so he, had, he went the, Continued down Points Road, turned around at the roundabout, the big roundabout, for uh, Pauls right. Avenue. Right. Uh, yeah. You do, um, wait, you come out, do a left. I, I was on the 23 one time, and we, we had a new driver, I mean, presumably he was new, I'd never seen him before, uh, and we went out of the interchange, obviously turned right, went down that bit. Uh, she got lost, she actually took the 23 into Church Street. <laughs> <laughs> Is that a really narrow street? Yeah. We got to at the top by where the um, 28 and 29 go from before she realised that she was actually in the complete wrong part of town. Um, and everyone on the bus was like, oh, what are you doing? Well, uh, um, <laughs> it was quite funny. Was anyone there to save the day? Uh, a couple of people, because I mean, most of us on that service are everyday commuters, so we just kind of were like, no, you just turn around, go out here. Yeah, you do it right. right in the roundabout. But I think it was like her first or second day without having a trainer. And that's 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 the scariest thing. When 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 you go out in service and you don't have the trainer. Because in case something goes wrong, that obviously if if the trainer's there he can help you straight out. Um but if the when the when the trainer's gone it's so scary. Exactly, yeah. So I mean, what I've got myself on do not disturb. WhatsApp. Four messages from two chats. Um, Pentley Park. Pentley Park. Trust me, when they make when they make this left path, it is gonna be epic. And they're also extending it to St Albans and Lister Hospital. How do you uh, how do you make a route in Omsey per se? 
uh, spleens are roads, so they can make it bend, and roundabouts and junctions and whatnot are called scenery objects because they um, go straight ahead here at both roundabouts. And Would, wouldn't it be awesome if we all like met up and we made our own kind of like little bus routes on there, you know, and we could do like our routes, we could do some of the looting routes or something. I mean, how cool that be? People all over the world play those and, you know, just having it's... the satisfaction that I made that. Yeah, it's, yeah it, it's that feeling, but um, we'll say it's quite hard to create oh, a map. Well, yeah. yeah, I was thinking of creating a one using Blender like uh, Rhys Daniels does. He's developing a, a London uh, map and it absolutely right. looks brilliant. Trust me, if you watch my uh, episode 2 on, on the Omzi buses, see that map, absolutely brilliant. Yeah, I can agree to that. I've watched that. It's so good. Um, but yeah. I would hope to develop one in Blender sometime soon, but it's going to be uh, hard work. At the moment, I want to try and develop an E300. You should, you should do our routes. Yeah, I was thinking, I tried Luton routes, and I thought, no, because I need Google Maps, and it don't have the uh, Luton have, interchange. Do, do the, um, the midterm one, it's the, sh it's the shortest one, so only you've got three stops on the actual line, literally out of the terminal, down the road, 100 metres, turn left, into the car park. Again. Yeah, it's possible, but as I said, I've I've got other things yeah, in my mind at the moment. Develop bus and yeah. yeah, but as I said, I've got um, other things in my mind at the moment, so it's fair enough that obviously I've. That's got... okay. I agree. With that. Yeah, obviously you know, um, you both know what's on my mind. There's, there's, there's certain things you don't need to kind of share on, you know. Yeah. Yeah. Or yeah. Do a left. Still though, nearly six months. Oh, you know. Sorry, my brother's like, since what? I'm like, you know. <coughs> yeah. So we're so just. Is this being streamed live then? So what? Is this being streamed live? No, it's not. We use Novolf to record, and hopefully at the end, I think Ben, you might. You do you have OneDrive, Ben? Yes. Stick it on OneDrive. I'll download it, I'll edit it and put it on YouTube. Awesome. Now I can do that at school, taking advantage of the 60 megabits per second upload speed. Okay. Yeah, you do a left here, do a left. This is going into Wellington City, we're not, we've gone past the Howard Centre. Alright, yep. Yeah. My uh, cousin used to work there, branch manager at Barclays. Alright. So wait, 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 you're lucky. You're lucky, yeah, I, yeah, I, saw that, it turn, I saw it turn, and I was like, no, you better wait. So yeah, we're nearly approaching the bus station now, guys. This is our second to last stop. Well, second to last stop on this recording. What would make you laugh is if someone got on, I mean, obviously it's not second to last stop the route, but when they, when they get on the bus, then they go like one stop. Yeah. That, that, if, if anybody else who is watching this is a bus driver, you will know the frustration when you get people to go one stop. You can you can walk back. Okay. <laughs> it's fair, yeah. fair enough if you're a pensioner and whatnot. Yeah, I mean if if you've got a reason, that's that's fine. But if you just can't be bothered to walk it, then why why should I stop and take time out of my busy schedule? To, you know, compensate just for you. Just down the wrong one stop. <laughs> I mean, especially some some of our stops. If you, if, obviously, like I say, if you've been on our buses, you'll know that some of our stops are only kind of a hundred meters apart, if that. Mm. You know, within throwing distance of each other. Go to the roundabout and do a U-turn. Okay. Oh yeah, I remember that. So, yeah, this is Welling Garden City, guys. Okay. We have got four minutes here, but we're finishing recording here. That's good. We're having a nice little tea break here. Yeah, we'll let you viewers uh, finish off. Whatever. Yeah, don't forget. I know. It's, I know. I say it's in all my videos. Like, comment, and subscribe. Please show your support. Thank you. And um, any requests if I've got the map, if I've got the buses, even. I'm, I'm sure we can do it for you. Yeah. yeah. I agree. And also, yeah, if you're a fellow bus enthusiast, please like our Facebook page, facebook.com/slash on the shears buses and. Post your post your pictures and photos to us and your stories. We'd love to hear from you. You go to the far. Uh, wait, I'm trying to think which end. Far end, I do believe. 
they have like bus stop names, you know, bus stop one, bay two. Yeah, yeah, we're stopping at the far end. Alright. So yeah, this is our time to go, I think, isn't it? Until 55 minutes. Oh yeah, yeah, 55, we've got two minutes. Yeah, so this is our time to uh, finish off, I do believe. Am I right in saying that, Ben? Yes, we are. So, any messages you guys would like to both say before before Ben cuts us off? Don't become a bus driver. <laughs> um, I just, as I said, I'd like to say just like, comment, and subscribe. Definitely. Um, ben, anything you want to say before? No, just like it, comment, subscribe, and yeah. keep bussing. Anything you like, just say. I can. I've got all the buses, most of the maps. Just mention what you want, and we can do it for you. Yeah, and also Helen tutorials. Feel free if you want to inquire about them. We can do it for you as well. Apart from Johnny, he's got Windows 98 that's now smashed. <laughs> yeah. Or Josh, sorry. Um. But yeah, I think that's it, isn't it? That's it, guys. I think. So thanks for watching. I think, I think, I think, yeah, I think Ben should actually close us off because it's fair enough. It's his uh, game.